Okay. Can I get a thumbs up? Yes. All right, may the fourth be with you. We have a Star Wars themed day today. We've got some Jedi training. Happy May 4th. And we have a special birthday in the house. Whose birthday is it? Yay! It's Quinn. How old are you, Quinn? Seven. seven. Big seven. Ooh, happy oh. birthday. Oh, you are. Yes, Miss Hilda. Older, wiser. <laughs> all right let's begin our jedi training here we go i am yoda the master I good afternoon everybody welcome to jedi training i'll be your host my name is mr paterno mr tang will be with us shortly first thing we'd like to do is go over the expectations for today's lesson we have the word jedi as our acronym the J is for just have fun. We want everybody to have a great time today. The E is for earn your Jedi Master Certificate. The D is for do your best. And the I is for inspire yourself and others. All right, let's get started with seeing how everybody's feeling today. Can we get a thumbs up if you're doing great, if you're happy, thumbs to the side if you're just okay, and a thumbs down if you're having a bad day. We're gonna try to make that better. All right, I see a lot of thumbs up, great job. All right, let's get started. First activity, we're going to swing our arms like Kylo Ren's saber. You're going to have arms extended to the sides, palms facing down, moving outwardly in a circular motion. Begin. That's good, everybody has their arms facing out, palms facing down. Looking at the circles, great job. Smaller to bigger. Great job, George. Devin, looking good, working hard. Great job, Zach. Big circles with those arms. Great job, Diana. Great All job. All right, next today. activity. We're going to do neck rolls with BB-8. We're going to roll our neck from side to side, back and forward. Nice and slow. You may begin. Let's see those neck rolls. Good job, Levi. Great job, Michaela. We're gonna go back to forward and left to right. Get a full circle of motion. Stretch out those, those necks. Get on screens all day. We need to get ready for our main activity. Great job, Dennis. Good job, Shanice. All right, class, next activity. We're going to pull our arms over our heads like Obi-Wan Kenobi. We're going to be doing tricep links. Please grab your arm at the opposite arm over your shoulder, linking with each other. Similarly to shoulder stretches, you may begin. Great job, Shanice. You and your son look great. Working hard. Good job, Jose. Those arms up, try to reach back. Grab that elbow. Great job, Reina. Everybody looks good. Everybody's working. Everybody's moving. All right, next activity are going to be arm raises with Grogu. So you're going to wave your hands like Grogu. Arms extended over your head, reaching to each side from a sitting position or a standing position. You may begin. All right, get those hands up. Great job, Devin. Reach for the sky. Good job, Dr. Bittner. Good job, everybody. Looks like they're stretching. Michaela, great job. Great effort. Great job, Diane. Good job, Zach. Those arms extended. Reach for the sky. 
All right, next activity are going to be Superman stretches like an R-wing fighter jet. So you're gonna fly like an R-wing fighter jet. From a sitting position or a laying down position, you're going to have your arms and feet extended. Your core is touching the floor if you're laying down and you're extending out, begin. Okay, for those of you laying down, your abs, your abdominals, your stomach, your core are all gonna be touching the ground. Legs are coming up and arms are coming up. You are in a sitting position. You are just doing the upper body motion that you see there, reaching for the sky again, flying like an R-wing fighter jet. Great job, Shanice. Good job, Reina. Thank you for working hard, students. Okay, great job. Next activity, we're going to be marching like a stormtrooper. Whether you're sitting or standing, your arms are gonna move in opposition to your legs and elbows are bent with a brief period if you're standing where both feet are off the surface. Your arms are bent at a 90 degree angle. Ready, begin. Great job, get those arms pumping. We're almost at our main activity where Mr. Tang is going to teach you how to be a Jedi Master. Let's get warm. Great job, Michaela. Good job, Levi. Get those knees up. Pump those arms. Great job, class. Good job, George. Down and with Darth Vader. All right, great job. Next activity is going to be lightsaber scissor chops with Darth Vader. You're going to have your arms extended above your head, chopping down and up in scissor motions. You can be in a sitting position or standing. Ready, begin. All right, so everybody's chopping up and down. If you're in a sitting position, you can get those legs going. If you're uh, standing, you do both. Great job, pump those arms. Good job, Shanice. Looks good, Devin. Everybody's working hard. Great job, Reina. Andrea's moving. Good job, Dennis. Great job. Michaela's adding a little jump to it. That's what we like. A little extra effort. Good job, George. All right, great job. Next activity, we're going to be doing swinging of the chains like Padme. Your arms are going to be extended on either side of you, chopping downward as if chopping wood. Ready, begin. Great job. You can go right hand first and down and switch it to left, or you can stay with your right, your choice. As long as you're moving, movement is the key to exercise, and exercise is the key to a long, happy, healthy life. Great job, students. Good job, Dennis. Good effort. Andrea, great job. Good. Shanice, you're working hard. All right, great job, class. Next activity, we're going to be doing jumping jacks with the Ewoks. You're going to go jumping jack position from a standing or sitting position. When you are extended, you are a pencil at the top. And when you are extended in the outward position, you are a star pattern. Ready, begin. Good job. Love to see those full body jumping jacks. If you're sitting, just get those arms going. Great job, we're at a pencil at the top and a star at the sides. Zach's working hard, great job. Thank you, Michaela. Dennis, good job. Levi, great job, working hard. Good job, Devin, I see you. Great job, Dr. Bittner and friends. Everybody's moving. All right, last warm up class. We're going to do side bend crunches with Chewbacca, Han, and Finn. Arms up. Fingers to ears, legs up to arms. Ready, begin. All right, if you're sitting, you're just gonna bring your elbow down to your sides, opposite sides, left and then right. And if you're standing, you're gonna bring those legs up. Try to touch those elbows. Our last activity for warm-ups. All right, great job, class. If you can hear me, clap once. If you can hear me, clap twice. And if you can hear me, clap three times. Great job. All right, we'll be starting our Jedi training with Mr. Tang. Hi everyone, I'm Anthony. I'm gonna take you all through a Jedi Knight's training workout. Let's get into it. Before we get into the activity, I'm gonna introduce what the lightsaber grip is, since we're gonna be using this throughout the whole workout. So what we're gonna do is first is we're gonna grip our hands into fists, then we're gonna place one over the other, and we're gonna hold it at chest level height. 
Alright, when we begin the workout, there's gonna be two versions of the exercise. It's gonna be a standing version and a seated version. Let's get into it. The first exercise we'll be doing is the twist and block. So first we're gonna hold up our lightsaber grip to the center of our body at chest level and we're gonna twist left and right. And we're gonna do this for 30 seconds and go. Good job, Quinn and friend. My name is Matilda. Good job, Matilda. I like the way you're turning left and right, Devin. Good job turning, Five Andrea. Five seconds. Good job, Clark. I mean, Clark. And stop. You all did a great job. Next, we'll be blocking left and right. So we're going to hold the lightsaber grip still at chest level, and we're going to alternate extending our arms left and right to the side of our body. And we're going to do this for 30 seconds each, and go. I like the way you're extending your arms, Zach. Nice long stretches, oh, Dennis. You're all doing such a great job. 10 more seconds. And stop. You all did a great job. Let's go on to the next exercise. Alright, the next activity we'll be doing is blocking our heads from the left and right side. So first, we're going to hold our lightsaber grip at chest level, and then we're going to extend our arms towards our head, blocking the left and right side, and we're going to do alternating sides. We're going to do this for 30 seconds each, and go! I like the way you're blocking your head, Reyna. You young Jedis are doing great. 10 more seconds. Let's try to bring our arms a little higher, Levi. And stop, you all did such a great job. You young Jedi's did a great job, so you guys deserve a 20 second rest. Let's shake out those arms, catch our breaths, get a quick drink of water. Or make sure you're in a great area to work out. Make sure you're free from other uh, things okay, around. Okay, let's move on to the next exercise. So next we'll be doing is the force push. We're gonna stand straight. We're going to bend our knees slightly, and we're going to hold our palms face forward at chest level. And next is we're going to alternate pushing across our chest left and right, and we're going to do this for 30 seconds. And go. Levi, we're, we're uh, pushing across our chest, not in front of us. Good job. 10 more seconds. You're all doing such a great job. Jose, we're pushing across our chest. Let's try to earn our dojo point. And stop, young Jedi. The next activity we'll be doing is the downward lightsaber strike. So what we're going to do is we're going to hold our lightsaber grip at chest level. And we're going to bring our arms to the back of our heads and we're going to pretend we're like we're cutting something in half. We're going to do this continuously for 30 seconds and go. I like the way you're striking downward, Andrea. I like your form, Michaela. Keep it up. You Jedi's got this. 10 more seconds left. And we're striking downward, not, a, not slashing right across your chest. And stop. Good job. Alright, the next exercise we'll be doing is the force push and stab. So what we're going to do is, we're going to hold both hands at chest level, palm facing forward, and the other grip to the fist, pretending you're holding a lightsaber with one hand. And what we're going to do next is we're going to push and stab, alternating hands. We're going to do this for 30 seconds continuously, and go! 
Great job, Matilda and uh, Quinn. Levi, we're force pushing and stabbing, not punching. There we go. We got 10 seconds left, young Jedi. And stop. Great job, young Jedi. You young Jedi did such a great job. You all deserve a 20 second rest. Let's shake out those arms, grab a drink of water if we need to, catch our breath. Let's move on to the next exercise. The next activity we're going to do is we're going to squat and then we're going to block our heads from the left and right side. So when we're squatting, we're going to make sure our legs are bending at a 90 degrees, and as soon as we're up, we're going we're gonna to block from the left and right side, alternating each sides when we come up. We're going to do this for 30 seconds continuously, and go! Good job blocking, Levi! Come on, Cassie, let's participate. You got this, young Jedi. Ten more seconds left. Well, they were blocking our heads, not across our chest. Great there job. You all can stop now. The next activity we'll be doing is a torso twist and force push. So, we're going to do one complete torso twist left and right, and as soon as we're finished with that, we're going to force push across our chest left and right and we're going to just continuously for 30 seconds and go come on Devin let's participate there we go I like your rotation ten more seconds left you're all doing a great job I like how your hands run across your chest, Diane. Great job, you all can stop now. The next exercise we'll be doing is the lunge and block forward. So first thing first, we're gonna hold our lightsaber grip at chest level, and then we're gonna lunge. Once our leg bends at a 90 degrees, we're gonna push our lightsaber in front of us forward. We're gonna do this for 30 seconds non-stop, and go. I like the way you're pushing, uh, Dennis. Cassidy, we're doing the lunge and block forward. Ten more seconds, young Jedi. There we go. Come on, Jose, let's participate too. Great job, everyone. You can stop now. Young Jedi did such a great job. I think you all deserve a 20 second rest. Let's get some water, catch our breath, shake out our arms, legs, and everything. Make sure to use this time to hydrate. Alright, let's move on to the next exercise. The next exercise we'll be doing is the side lunge and force push. First thing first is we'll stand with our lightsaber grip at chest level and then we're going to side lunge. As soon as our legs bend, we're going to want to force push with our opposite hand across our chest and we're going to do this continuously for 30 seconds and go. Devin, we're side lunging and force pushing. Great job force pushing, George. How low you're going, 10 more seconds, young Jedi. Jose, we're, we're force pushing across our chest, all, alternating hand. There we go. Great job, all. You all can stop. 
Alright, the next activity we're going to be doing is to strike down and lunge. So first thing first is we're going to hold our lightsaber grip chest level. Then after that, one, we're going to lunge forward. And once we come back from the lunge, we're going to do we're going to strike down as if we're chopping something down with our lightsaber. We're going to do this continuously for 30 seconds. And go. Nice chops, Michaela. Devin, where'd you go? Let's try to be back on camera. There you are. You got this young Jedi. Master Yoda's proud of you. Ten more seconds left. I like your downward strike, Reyna. Great job. Great job, all. You can all stop now. Alright, we're down to our last exercise. What we're going to do next is the squat and force push. So first thing first is we're going to stand straight and we're going to hold our hands at chest level, palms face forward. And what we're going to do next is we're going to squat. As soon as we come up from the squat, we're going to force push across our chest left and right. We're going to do this continuously for 30 seconds. Let's give it our all and go. I like how low you're going, Dennis. Come on, Jose. We're, we're, we're pushing across our chest. Alternating hands. There we go. I like the way you're pushing. Andrea. Let's push through this, young Jedi. We're almost done. Ten more seconds. Devin, I can't see you, buddy. And stop. You all did such a wonderful job. Alright, let's finish this workout with a little check for understanding. Do you all remember what the force push exercise was? Is it A or B? If you all said A, you're correct. That's all for this exercise. I'm gonna pass the torch down to Mr. Paterno and he's gonna go over some cooldowns with Master Yoda. Alright, great job everybody. You are now one step closer to earning your Jedi Master Certificate. All right, let's cool down with some yoga with Master Yoda. First activity, Master Yoda says spread out and touch the floor. We're doing forward bends, spread out, legs extended in triangle pose if you're standing. If you're sitting, you can have your legs by your side and you are touching your toes. Ready, begin. You gotta make sure those legs are extended if you're standing. If you're sitting, you're bringing your back, your arms all the way down. Great form, Reyna. Great job, Dr. Bittner. Good job, Matilda. Wonderful job, Quinn. Good job, Cassidy. All right, great job, everyone. Next activity, Master Yoda tells us to twist our spine. We're doing spine twists from a sitting or a laying position. Extend to one side and then alternate your side using your back or your legs, depending on if you're sitting or standing. Ready, begin. Uh, moving from right to left, and then left to right, making sure not to move too quickly. Moving over your left and right shoulder if you're in a sitting position. And if you're laying down, your legs are alternating left to right. Great job, Zach. Good movement. Good job, Shanice. I like how you're moving nice and slow. All right, great job, everyone. Next one, we're going to fly like the Millennium Falcon dodging blasters. So you're going to be doing your alternating horizontal toe touches. Arms are extended at the sides, moving downward to touch your toes as you see in the pictures from a sitting position or standing. Ready, begin. Okay, so you're moving your left hand to your right foot, and your right hand to your left foot. Alternating, meaning going back and forth, Good job, Devin. Zach, you're getting a great exercise. Good job, Elsie. Thank you for working hard, Jose. Get those arms straight up, guys. Good job, ladies and gentlemen. Good job, Dennis. Great job, going All right, Great job, everyone. Master Yoda says now we are doing alternating vertical toe touches. So your arms are going to be extended, touch the floor using alternating arms, 
with your arms straight out, touch those toes like an X-Wing fighter jet. Begin. Good job. We're gonna try to bring those arms up to a vertical position, meaning up and down, straight up and down. Try not to have any bend in your elbows. And then going to the other side. Good job. George, don't fly away. Great job, great effort. Good job, Dennis. Good job, Levi. Good job, class. Next one, we're going to be doing back rounders. So you're going to have a rounding and extending of your back from the kneeling or sitting position. As you see in the pictures, you may begin. Good job, Dennis. Andrea, are you with us? Great job, Reina. Bring that head and neck down if you're in the sitting position. And if you're on your knees, you're going to go ahead and extend that back and roll that back. Good job, Matilda. Great job, Reina. Good movements. Good effort, Devin. Good job, class. Okay, next cool down activity. We're going to be doing overhead touches. You're going to pull your arm over your head and reach for your toes. Arms are extended, reach for those toes or reach to your side from a sitting position or a standing position. Ready, begin. You may go to either side. You may also alternate if you'd like to. If you're sitting down, make sure those legs are completely extended. And if you're standing up or sitting in a chair, make sure those arms are above your head, reaching for the sky and going towards one side. And you may alternate or stick with that side. Levi, you're working really hard. Thank you. Great job, Devin. Great job, Diane. Shanice, I see you. Good job. Great job, everyone. All right, our next cool down activity is to sit down and twist like C3PO. Going to have your arms by your side, rotating at your back, using your alternate sides. You can also have your arms up if you're sitting. You may begin. Try to keep that back straight if you're in the sitting position or if you're on the ground. Rotating over your left and right shoulders, or you can just stick with one side, your choice. Try to turn around all the way and face beside, behind you and get a good stretch in that lower back. Good job, Levi. Working hard, Devin, thank you. All right, next activity. It's going to be a downward dog position. Pull your hips back and keep your back straight in a downward facing Wookie position. If you're sitting, you can just do your toe touches. Ready, begin. Good job, Jedi Masters. Try to make your body look like a triangle doing the full position. Sitting down, you're gonna bring that head, neck, and back towards your feet, towards the ground. Great job. Good job, Andrea. All right, great job, everyone. All right, now we're going to pull our chest up and lean back like R2-D2. It's going to be similar to a sun salutation yoga position. You may begin. All right, if you're sitting, try to get a straight back, bending at your midsection. If you're laying down again, you're bending at the mid midsection, trying to bring your chest up and your head up. Legs stay on the ground if you're in the laying position. Great job, Elsie. Make sure we're all breathing. Breath work is very job, important. Everyone. And lastly, we're going to lay flat or sit straight, depending on your choice. We're going to calm our breathing. Breathing in through the nose and the mouth and exhaling. Breathing in through the nose or the mouth and exhaling again. Calm your breathing and feel the force. Great job, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mr. Paterno, for that wonderful cool down. We're gonna wrap things up here with a couple of checks for understanding. So what were the cues or steps for running in place? If you said this, you are correct. All right, one more check for understanding. So which GIF or picture is the lightsaber twist and block? Is it A or B? 
Hey, 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 all right, the last thing I want to ask is how are we still feeling? Are we happy still? Are we okay? Or are we mad or sad still? That's great. I see a lot of thumbs up. You all did it. We're all Jedi Masters now. I hope you all had a great work on me and Mr. Paterno. And have a great day. Excuse me. Ow. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. You can have these guys. Oh, I thank you. Just what I need. <laughs> All right. The force was strong with us during that workout. Happy May 4th. May the 4th be with you. Mr. Yoda. Yes, with Mr. Yoda. Thanks for joining us today. We will be back with the APE cohort on Thursday for our very last um, ASAP, online ASAP of the year. And tomorrow, Wednesday at one o'clock, same deal. It will be our last intro to APE uh, transition practicum of the semester. Thanks for joining us. Till next time. Bye.